CompTIA A plus Core 1 Complete Training Course. Exam Objective 5.2. Give them a scenario, troubleshoot problems related to motherboards, RAM, CPU, and power. This video will cover troubleshooting issues related to motherboards, RAM, CPU, and power. For each of the common symptoms listed in the CompTIA A plus Core 1 Exam Objective 5.2, I will provide some basic information and possible root causes. Additionally, as a pro test taking tip, you should always perform verifications, inspections, or checks before performing any repairs or component replacements. When a computer system fails to power on, it signals a potential array of underlying issues that require attention. One primary culprit for this scenario could be a malfunctioning power supply unit, or PSU, which is responsible for supplying electrical power to the computing device. A faulty PSU may fail to deliver adequate power or fail entirely, preventing the system from starting up. Additionally, Loose connections between the power supply cables and the motherboard, CPU, or other components can disrupt the flow of electricity, resulting in a failure to power on. Furthermore, the PSU may not be receiving power from the wall outlet. If the computing device has sufficient power, it will proceed to the power on self-test or post. If everything checks out okay during the post, a single audible beep will be heard. Otherwise, a series of beeps will be triggered, indicating a potential hardware malfunction. These audible alerts or beeps play a crucial role in diagnosing underlying issues. Each beep pattern will correspond to a specific hardware problem, with the most common culprits being motherboard malfunctions, memory failures, or CPU issues. By recognizing and deciphering these post-beep codes, Users can promptly address the root cause, whether it involves examining the motherboard for defects, such as chipset failures, damaged capacitors, corrosion, or loose components, troubleshooting memory modules to see if they have failed or become unseated, or inspecting the CPU for failure or a disconnected CPU fan. Encountering a black screen upon startup can be indicative of several potential hardware issues within a computer system. One possible cause for this occurrence is a problem with the motherboard. This could prevent the power on self-test from ever taking place or cause a beep code. Similarly, problems with the graphics card or the display can also result in a black screen scenario. Additionally, Issues with the power supply unit can contribute to a black screen situation. If your device has power, gets past the post test, and does not encounter a black screen, then it will continue on with the boot process. The next stage is to load the operating system. This is where you may encounter a proprietary crash screen. Encountering proprietary crash screens, such as the infamous blue screen of death on Windows systems or the spinning pinwheel on macOS, is often a distressing experience for computer users. These screens serve as indicators of critical system errors that require immediate attention. One common culprit behind these crash screens is driver conflicts, where incompatible or outdated device drivers clash with the operating system leading to system instability and crashes. Furthermore, faulty hardware components can also trigger these crash screens. Issues such as damaged motherboards, failing RAM modules, malfunctioning graphics cards, or overheating CPUs can all contribute to system crashes and the appearance of proprietary crash screens. Overheating is another threat to the stability and performance of computer systems. One of the primary consequences of overheating is system instability, wherein the computer may exhibit erratic behavior, unexpected shutdowns, or even hardware damage. Several factors contribute to overheating, with inadequate cooling mechanisms being a primary concern. Insufficient airflow within the computer case, inadequate ventilation, or poorly designed cooling systems can all exacerbate heat buildup, leading to elevated temperatures. Additionally, the accumulation of dust and debris on internal components 
can impede heat dissipation, compounding the problem. Another common cause of overheating is a malfunctioning fan. If a fan fails to operate at optimal speeds or stops working altogether, the computing device can quickly reach dangerously high temperatures. Sluggish performance is a frustrating issue that can significantly impair the functionality and efficiency of a computer system, hindering productivity and user experience. One common underlying cause of sluggishness is insufficient compute resources such as CPU processing power, available RAM, or available storage. Another factor contributing to sluggishness is CPU overheating. When the CPU reaches excessively high temperatures due to inadequate cooling or airflow within the system, it may throttle or reduce its processing speed to prevent damage. Intermittent shutdowns are another concern facing computing devices. These abrupt shutdowns may stem from various underlying causes, necessitating thorough investigation to pinpoint the root problem. One potential reason for these shutdowns is a faulty power supply. Fluctuations in power delivery or outright failures can trigger sudden system shutdowns. Power supplies with insufficient wattage ratings can also lead to the same issue. Additionally, Overheating poses another significant concern. When critical components, such as the CPU or graphics card, reach excessive temperatures due to poor ventilation or malfunctioning cooling systems, the system may automatically shut down to prevent damage, manifesting as intermittent shutdowns during operation. Frequent application crashes can significantly disrupt productivity and frustrate users, often indicating underlying issues within the computer system. The cause behind these crashes may be faulty RAM. When RAM modules develop defects or fail to function properly, they can corrupt data or cause applications to crash unexpectedly. Additionally, software conflicts can also trigger frequent application crashes. Incompatible software versions, conflicting drivers, or corrupted system files can create conflicts within the operating system, causing applications to malfunction and crash. Moreover, insufficient storage can exacerbate application crashes, as a lack of available disk space can impede the proper functioning of applications and the operating system. The detection of a burning smell within a computer system serves as a potent warning sign hinting at potentially severe hardware issues that demand immediate attention. This cue typically indicates overheating or damage to internal components, signifying a critical situation that requires swift resolution. The source of the burning smell may vary, with just about every hardware component being a possible cause. For instance, a malfunctioning PSU may emit a distinct burning odor when its internal components become overheated or compromised. Similarly, a damaged motherboard or overheating CPU can also produce a burning smell, signaling imminent hardware failure or damage. Prompt action is imperative when detecting such a scent, as ignoring it could lead to irreversible damage, data loss, or even a fire hazard. When a burning smell is encountered, Users should immediately power off the system, unplug it from the power source, and seek professional assistance to diagnose and address the underlying cause. Capacitors are essential electronic components found on computer motherboards and other circuit boards, tasked with storing and releasing electrical energy as needed. They serve various functions within the system, including stabilizing voltage levels and regulating current flow. When a capacitor becomes swollen or bulging, it signifies a significant issue known as capacitor swelling, which often indicates impending component failure. This swelling occurs due to internal pressure buildup caused by factors such as excessive heat, prolonged usage, or manufacturing defects. As the capacitor expands beyond its normal dimensions, it can disrupt the electrical circuitry and functionality of the motherboard. This disruption can lead to system instability, erratic behavior, or even complete system failure. Additionally, in severe cases, the swelling of capacitors can result in the leakage of electrolytic fluid, 
which may emit smoke and a distinct burning smell as it comes into contact with other components or circuitry. Lastly, the CMOS is a component within a computer system that aids in preserving BIOS settings, including system date, time, and hardware configuration details. The CMOS is essentially a small onboard battery used to retain these settings even when the computer is powered off. Inaccurate system date and time settings can often be attributed to issues related to the CMOS battery. The CMOS battery provides backup power to maintain the integrity of these settings when the main power source is disconnected. However, if over time, this battery may degrade or lose its charge, leading to inaccuracies in system date and time settings. Detecting inaccuracies in system date and time settings is crucial as they can affect various system functions, including file timestamping, software licensing, and scheduled tasks. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.